Good morning 10CG. I'm just doing my weekly Monday morning um, virtual tutor time with you. Um, so I just want to say I hope you had a, um, a nice week last week. Um, again the weather has been amazing so it's been lovely to be able to get out and to go for my daily walks in a really um, in the beautiful sunshine. We are what is it? I think it's almost five weeks since we've been in school, so this is almost, I think by the end of this week this will be the same amount of time that you would have for your summer holidays out of school. So we are, I suppose, um, getting into the, a bit of the, the long haul. But I thought that this poster that I popped up, that I found on my um, Instagram feed would show you some useful ideas if, in case that you got a little bit or you're a little bit stuck on things to do kind of running out of ideas um, and also I think it's a really nice poster just to remind ourselves that this won't be forever this is a temporary um, situation that we are currently in at the moment so um, I think there's some really nice suggestions here um, exercise which I always try to recommend to you so run walk do yoga do aerobics um, cut down on your social media I do find and you're probably um, the same is that I do find I'm looking at Facebook and Instagram and um, the news channels um, on my phone all the time and it's not necessarily um, the best thing for your mental health. Sometimes we need to um, put our phones to the side and and just kind of, um, you know, stop looking at these apps. Um, so I've been trying to do make a conscious effort um, to try and um, do that. Um, but perhaps one of the best things is to keep in contact with your friends and family. So, you know, like, we may not be able to be physically in the same room, but a phone call or a Zoom chat or quiz with your friends um, might be the next best thing um, for this. Um, learn a new skill. I think there's been a lot of pressure on, like, oh, you should um, pick up a new... Um, skill like I don't know crocheting or sewing or whatever um, and that's that's really up to you yeah there's definitely is the time to um, develop these skills do more crafting and um, but also don't feel the pressure that you know you should be achieving all these amazing things it's this is these activities are really to uh, provide you a kind of an outlook um, outlook um, uh, somewhere to you know just to kind of give you some pleasure in in life I suppose these um, these activities you shouldn't it shouldn't feel like um, that you know you should be learning a new language it's not a competitive thing it's a it's um, for your own like well-being so if there's something that you really enjoy now now is maybe the time to you know be able to sp spend a bit more time on that thing that you really enjoy I know that uh, Mr. Johnson is sending out um, lots of reading tasks for us it's always important to keep up our our reading skills and um, enjoy a good book sing, dance, all these types of things. Um, but as always, if there's um, anything that we can help you with or you need any um, support from the school, please do feel to, free to contact myself or um, Mr Giles and we'll be happy to, to help or to refer you to the... Um, to the people that we have to support you best within school. Um, anyway, we, myself and Mr. Giles, um, um, hope that you're all doing well. And I will speak to you again next week, unless I hear from you beforehand.